Hawthorne police have recovered a hard drive containing more than $1 million worth of original music that was stolen recently from a car belonging to Derek mixed by Ali Ali, rapper Kendrick Lamar's Grammy Award-winning producer. The theft occurred December 7 when two men broke into Arlie's BMW i8 and two other vehicles parked outside the Equinox gym on Rosecrans Avenue in Hawthorne. Attempts to reach Ali on Wednesday were unsuccessful. Police said Ali was grateful that officers found the hard drive and returned it to him. He is very, very happy, Hawthorne Police Lt. James Royer said. Another copy, however, remains at large. The device is encrypted so it is of no use to whoever has it. Still, Ali was glad to get one copy back, Royer said. It was unclear whether the hard drive contained works by Lamar or other artists. Ali, who grew up in Gardena, is a 27-year-old sound engineer for Top Dog Entertainment. In 2015, he won a Grammy for producing Lamar's To Pimp a Butterfly. He is nominated for two Grammys in 2018 Album of the Year for producing Lamar's Dam and Record of the Year for producing Humble. Ali is just as important as the person writing, making the beats and expressing himself on the microphone, Lamar told Ozzy.com in a 2016 article. They say there's an actual frequency that hits a nerve connected to your brain and makes you say that you like a song. That's something that Ali understands very well. Detectives recovered the music following the December 8 arrest of Joan Jero Espinoza, 23, of Los Angeles who left his fingerprint on Arlie's car door during a break-in a day earlier, Royer said. Espinoza and another man being sought have since been tied to car burglaries in Hawthorne, Carson, Torrance and Los Angeles, stealing property that included an off-duty sheriff's deputy's handgun, passes to SeaWorld in San Diego, golf clubs, clothing, power tools, cologne and car parts. Besides the break-ins outside the Equinox gym, Burglaries occurred outside a 24-hour fitness in Carson and shopping centers in Torrance, Royer said. Basically these guys are serial car burglars, Royer said. They prey upon victims who leave items viewable from the outside. Using a spring-activated device that pierced glass windows to get inside, the alleged burglars took property in seconds, Royer said. Victims, including Ali, reported three crimes on December. 7 in Hawthorne. Security camera footage revealed two men in a white hatchback were responsible for at least two of the crimes. A Hawthorne police forensic investigator lifted the fingerprint off of Arlie's car, Royer said. Police quickly identified Espinoza as a suspect and investigated two addresses linked to him. They found the white car in Hacienda Heights, Royer said. Investigators put the car under surveillance and soon saw Espinoza move items from another vehicle into the white hatchback and drive away. Officers pulled him over and arrested him. The hard drive was in Espinoza's car. I don't think he knows what he had, Royer said. Detectives later searched the Hacienda Heights address and an location in the 1100 block of South Herbert Avenue in Los Angeles. We found gift cards video recorders, Louis Vuitton bags, golf clubs, Royer said.